Cancers, welcome back to my channel. This is Brooke Terrell. We're getting right into your July monthly love reading, Cancers. The camera is trying to focus back in. Happy birthday to you. Let's see what comes out for the rest of July uh, in regards to love, Cancers. Okay, all the energy is the page of cups. For some of you, you could be with child or then. Um, air sign or you could have a child already doesn't have to be but there's third party energy going on someone has a family um, or the wish fulfillment is a family but work or time or just being emotionally unavailable is in the way for some of you you don't want to walk away from a connection cancers we have the eight of cups in reverse but this person is just emotionally wise like they're not opening up you know they're closed off king of swords energy gemini libra aquarius energy that they, they love going out or um, you go out on dates a lot, but the full moon coming on on Tuesday is really um, showing you that this isn't really working out or, or what you really want in an emotional sense. Yeah, you guys are having fun, but you see, you know, there's an ending that's coming in and you're just tired of having like this bad luck and love um, because it feels like all you want is this Ten of Cups cancer this is all you want to accomplish and it's like you're just tired of relationships being stagnant here for some of you cancers if you're dealing with a third party situation they have not left that situation with the hangman they still are hanging on to that family due to kids here right so they're kind of getting defensive you could be confronting this person about um them um living to living two different lives or potentially seeing their mother or the father or their child and they're kind of being manipulative right gaslighting the situation and putting the blame back on you cancers for some of you but we have hold your vision what you what you want in love is trying to come in but you have to be bold and make the first move here okay why because a new romantic cycle is trying to come in but you have to clear this stagnant energy out and for some of you you know we have meditation and <laughs> meditation and contemplate right now so yoga get grounded here meditate if you want to and emotions are running high you know you know what you want and this person isn't giving it to you okay cancers so let's get in the reading just saw 222 angel number as well so there's balance and patience that is needed here you know you don't want to force something that you know is not going to work out you know why hold on to a dead and relationship cancers okay we have the king of swords with the nine of swords this person is just going to keep leaving you in a confused state you know you are the empress you know what you are worth you need to um i feel like pull back half fun with your family your friends work on your goals here because you've been kind of neglecting your finances goals or you could be overspending okay cancers this month for the rest of the month um take control of that also want to yeah i feel like for some of you the third party energy is time their work right like they want to tend to you they see you as caring nurturing and giving you know and they and they want to tell you this but i feel like time is definitely in the way this person is attracted to you as well it could also be someone coming in from your past expressing their love for you because you deserve love this could also be for my single cancer to express love for yourself again empress energy here um, you know, with with your feminine energy, self-love, self-care, okay? Take yourself out on a date, you know, go out for your birthday. I also feel like someone's going to reach out um, on your birthday here. It could be dealing with another water sign. They're, they're uh, waiting on the right time to do so, and they might use your birthday as an excuse. Again, this person, for some of you, there's connection that you guys have been going out. Nothing serious, friends and benefits situation hooking up. But it's like this person senses that you want more and they regret that they can't give it to you. But they're not going to tell you that, you know, while you're being patient, wanting for things to work out here. You know, they're they're taking it slow with the page of wands. There's Sagittarius energy that is coming in wanting to communicate with you, Cancers. And again, leave the situation, third party situation behind because things are going to balance out for you. But you have to get again with the page of wands. Be bold and make this first move, Cancers, all right? We have heart with the key, welcoming love, meeting the one, opening your heart, getting together and perfect. There's a new love that's coming in that you have to be able to stop this pattern of um, being in emotionally available situations here. So separate, stop the pattern, and new love is going to come in. For some of you Cancers, you could be potentially meeting the one, and it's going to be perfect. That's what you guys are saying. We have the three of pentacles in reverse. So for some of you, you're just kind of watching, you know, 
um, not really turning a lot this month. You know, you're focusing on your financial and goals for some of you here. You're just watching, you know, your friends just living their lives. There's also a, a this is, sorry, I have to pause for a minute. There's an earth sign for some of you. Cancers or a fire sign that you're dealing with. There's water, okay. But there's someone from your past that's watching you that you did see long term with that they're now seeing it too, right? And they're going to try to heal this around the full moon. Uh, you could potentially hear from them next week. There is strong Pisces energy here, but they're, with the moon, there's something hidden that's going to be revealed and there's love here. They're going to tell you how they really feel. We have Leo energy. This full moon is going to push them to speak up. Um, what do they want to say? I'm actually going to take this uh, twin flame deck here. If I knew them, what I know now, I would have made different choices. Yeah, because they see you in your in your true light. You, you have been in my dreams, and how could you still love me after all I have done, Cancers? Okay, so someone's definitely thinking about you. We have the Six of Swords here. Apology coming in, Seven of Swords in reverse. It's kind of like Cancers. You've just been wanting this apology for some of you, for someone from your past that put you in a third party. Oh, I completely forgot if you're still here with me. I am gonna pull a one card message for my Cancers since this is um, for some of you your birthday month. So comment below with the heart or blue with a blue heart or blue butterfly if this resonates, and I will give you a one um, card love message for the rest of the month. Okay. But again, there's an apology that you've been manifesting and it's like someone is really thinking of over the choices that they have made in regards to love. This could also be you, you know, apologizing to yourself, healing that I'm never going to put myself through a situation like I have um, ever again. So, you know, you're in hermit mode. You're going to get into hermit mode for the rest of the month, Cancers. Hold on to your vision and really go deep within um, what you want. And again, meditate, contemplate, you know, boost your spirituality here because you are being guided by your spirit guides and we also have the will of fortune in reverse be mindful that you know nothing in life is permanent it's always temporary we have high moments in our lives while the will of fortune is upright we have low moment in our lives when the will of fortune is in reverse but it's always going to turn okay so you know you could be um feeling down a little bit cancers but there's a tire moment that's coming in that's going to awaken you and realize what you don't want and in doing so, you're gonna buy. You're gonna um, your vibration is gonna be high. Like it's gonna vibrate here with the emperor energy. You're gonna pull in a connection that is going to match exactly who you are and what you want. And you're gonna have your wish fulfillment because your spirit guides are saying to keep hanging on here. Let it go. Let it flow. Let go of a stagnant connection that's not getting any better. And tend to yourself. Okay. Page of Cups energy. Also with the Seven of Wands. You know it's time for you to stand guard. And release kind of anger here over this. Because again, Ace of Cups is here. There's a new beginning that's trying to come in for you, Cancers. Okay. We have the hangman. What's what else that is still hanging on that you need to learn, Cancers, for the rest of the month? Death card. That's we're going through a rebirth here. And things are not gonna flow until you make a decision. Okay. You have to make a decision. Holding on to something that makes you feel like crap. It's only making things worse. It's kind of like, you know, that old cliche, you're, you're hanging on to a hot coal, you're only burning yourself. We have King of Michael, principal, rational, ambitious, respected. Wisdom and objectivity are important right now. Stay in your activity, integrity, cancers. A situation that calls for honest and open communication. Again, I feel like you are going to get that apology that you want. We have justice. Fight for justice and equality for yourself. We have rulings made in your favor. Don't give up when it comes to love. Seven of Gabriel, stand up for what you believe in, have confidence, claim your personal power. Bottom of the deck, we have six of uh, REL, material needs get fulfilled in magical and unexpected ways, acts of kindness and giving, or receiving with a grateful heart here, okay? I'm going to clarify this, this five of pentacles, yeah. Have to trust yourself, trust your intuition right now, Cancers, focus on your goals, what you really want, your passions, your money here. Because in doing so, you are going to attract, again, an emperor, king of wands energy, who is just as motivated and wants to be loved as you. They're going to know exactly what they want, all right? Because you have to know exactly when you want to get that cancer, okay? I'm going to leave it there, guys, and have a wonderful week.